everyone, welcome back to the Scottish Cowboys Dart Channel. Today, as you can see from the screen, we're going to be reviewing Daryl Gurney's new 85% Pro Series darts from Winmouth. Now these have recently just been launched. I've not had a throw at them, not had a look at them. I bought these from St Helens Dart Shop. They are £39.95. They are available from other retailers, but as I said, I got them from St Helens Dart Shop. Just give them a phone, they'll get them sent out to your next day delivery. So let's do the normal, let's get them over to the table, have a good look at them, get them on the board, then we'll meet back here and we'll give them the ratings. So let's have a look at the one mow box. We've got a nice clear window showing the three barrels, nice colours, the nice reds and the blues. The one mouth point protector, one more logo, telling you it's a 23 grams that we're going to be reviewing. Nice picture of Daryl, telling you they're 85% tungsten. A little window with the prism uh, stems. On the side, you've got all the information you need for when you're stacking your darts if you're collecting them. Got it on both sides. On the back, just another picture of Daryl. A little bit of Information, Daryl Gurney's latest darts are built to deliver the integrity and outstanding playability Daryl demands from all his darts. Complete and stunning onyx finish. PDC major winner, Daryl Gurney. Telling you it's 85% tungsten again. Precision engineered. Onyx coating and it's match weighed to 0 0.05 of a gram. So let's get them opened and have a look at them. There you go. One of my darts come in the foam packaging, which I really like. The darts are not going to go anywhere. Nice and sturdy. You've got the little window, uh, windmill logo embossed into the packaging. You've got your three prism stems. Take one out. You've got your three flights. Take one of them out as well. And then you've got your three barrels. So we'll take one barrel out. Out the little windmill point protector. I like these point protectors. They are quite cool. Take one out. So firstly, we'll get a little look at Daryl's flight. As you can see, red, white and blue. Nice prism flight. I would say that's probably 100 microns. It's better to say now. Then you've got the Pro Force stem. Now, I don't know what size these are because it doesn't tell you on the box. So what I'll do is we'll give it a measure. It looks like a, a medium. But we'll give it a measure to see what size it is. It is 48.75 long, the stem. Supplied stem is 48.75 long. So here we go for a first look at the barrel. And as you can see, you've got... A nice black point on it. Take a measure of the point, see what size that is. And that is 26.9, so it's a standard 26 mil point. Now this has got a good bit of grip at the front. As you can see. It's very wide cut grooves at the front. As you can see, there was a tapered nose there. With a groove right at the start which takes the way the look of the taper but it is still tapered still tapering up to at least this point here of the barrel and it starts to straighten off so as I said it's a very wide grooves at the front coming up to the smooth band with the windmill logo on it use middle grippers I'm going to say right now you're not going to like this not going to get much grip you then come up to radius grooves that have been coated red and blue. It's really nice. Then you've got another section again. It's just a smooth section of the barrel. And then three thick ring grooves coated red and blue at the rear. Now, I'm going to put the stem in this just for a second. To see, right, front grippers, 
You've got a great grip. You've got at least a three. Middle grippers, you're getting a no bad grip as well. I'd say that was a three as well. You're missing that smooth bit. But rear grippers, unless you put a ringed stem with the grip on it, you're not going to get much grip at all. I'm going to give you a one and a half maximum. So we'll get some measurements took. So I went on to the Red Dragon website to get some sizes for the darts. Now, the steel tip come in 23 grams and 25 grams and the soft tip 20 grams. So when I came to get the measurements from them, I went on to the 25 grams and it told me they were 50.8 long and 7.16 millimeter diameter. So then I went on to 23 grams and it told me those two were 50.8 and 7.16 millimeter. It's just a mistake. It's just a wrong picture they've put up. The 23 are actually 50.8 by 6.6 millimeters because there's no way the darts two grams of difference can be the same the same dimensions it's just it just doesn't work they'd have to either drill the hole out more to get the less weight the 20 grams are 50.8 by 6.35 so let's check this one we're looking for 50.8 And we've got 50.7. So there's not really end in it. There you go, 50.8. I just didn't have a... 50.8 millimetres. The diameter, 6.6 .6 we're looking for. Oh, that's great. 666, six, six. oh no. 6.64, .6 so that's okay as well. So the sizes are okay. The, the look of it is really nice. I actually really like this dart. It's going to look good on the board. If you've been watching my reviews, you'll be noticed that I've, I've been really liking the natural tungsten finish, but this seems to just work. It's really nice. The prism stem. There you go. The Pro Force stem, not the prism. Pro Force stem, and it just gives it that extra bit of colour. So what I'll do now is I'll get the scales over. We'll get them weighed, then we'll get a super close up so we can get them onto the board. So we've got the scales ready. We've got two darts out. Just got three darts in our hand. Now they're saying these are 23 grams plus or minus 0 0.05 for a matched weight. So let's see. So we'll get 23.17. 23 23.16. And 23.14. So 0 0.03 of a difference. Absolutely brilliant. Really good. You're not going to get much better than that. Full setup. 24.93. I haven't got any of the new Fusion all-in-one stem and flight systems yet to check the difference in the weight. But I will get them at some point. So first of all we'll take a look at that really nice black point. Coming up to that detail I was telling you about with the grooves, they're very wide grooves. They're tapered at the front, coming up to the straight part of the barrel, giving that really good bit of grip at the front. Then you've got that smooth section, coming in to the further ring grooves. They've just got a small radius inside the grooves, painted red and blue. Coming up to the second section of the smooth band, back up to the radial grooves at the back again with the red, blue and red. Then you've got the Pro Force stem, making your way up to Darrow's new stun and flight. And that's the new Darrow Gurney 85% Pro Series.
So we've got the Darren Gurney's butt up. I've swapped out the stems and the flights to a set of Prism Force stems and a set of Red Dragon Hardcore flights. Stems are the same length, that's what I supplied and I think they're going to be too long. I like the feel at the front of that, the grip at the front is brilliant, it suits me down to a T. So we'll have a throw with these. If I think they're too long, I'll swap out the stems to a shorter stem and then see how we go on. First throw, 83. I'm going to tell you right now, they're far too long for me. They're really hitting my collarbone as I pull the dart back. So I'll go one more throw, then I'm going to swap them out for a shorter stem. A nice wee 58. The 18 wasn't meant, I was waiting for it. So what I'll do is, I'll pause this video, I'll swap out the stems. And we'll go back to the throne. So I swapped out the stems to a set of intermediate size stems. Let's see how we go on with these. Oh. Much better. I feel more comfortable with them with that. But one thing I'm going to say with these darts, they go through the air. Super. A nice V60. I like the way they look on the board. The colours are sticking out really, really nice. They're a really easy back to throw. If you're a front gripper like me, the grip level on the front is phenomenal. It gives you that confidence when you're pushing it. But it also gives you that confidence that it's not going to stick. It's a perfect grip. So let's get on to the 201 challenge and see how we do. That's better. I can't hide from you, girl, anymore. You got a corner. One hundred and forty. You require twenty. So light me up. Light me up. Strike a match, girl. Set me on fire. And light me up. Light me up. Pour on the gas, girl. Set me on fire. Sixteen. No score. You require four. Yes, it's 
shots and have a night. Let's recap on the Daryl Gurney 85% Pro Series windmill darts. I really like these darts. Uh, I couldn't hit a double in the 2 on 1 challenge, but I'm not too bothered about that. They were dead. They felt really good coming out of my hands. You've got to remember, I've only threw with them for 5 10 minutes maximum because I only do the little throne section then I go to the 2 one challenge I've not had these out of the box before then but they felt so comfortable in my hands with the supplied setup they were far too long for me if you like a long dart that's going to shoot you but the barrel is brilliant it's really really nice grip rating for the front it's a 3 for the middle it's a 2 and for the rear it's a 1.5 I fitted let's see the right here the uh, prism force stems on them and you get an extra bit of grip at the back with them so that would help use rear grippers if you want to use it that way but it's a long enough dart with a long stem in it I went for the intermediate I would maybe even try a short don't know or, or mess about it but I'm going to have a wee throw them I really liked them value for money £39.95 under a tenner 85% under £40 sorry it's 85% tungsten. It's all day long. It's a 10 out of 10. It's a really good dart. I've never tried any Daryl Gurney darts before, but I made a look at it and getting the other ones to try them as well. Overall, this is an 8.5 out of 10. Only reason it's 8.5 out of 10, it could have been a 9, is because the supplied stems are too long for me. So I would have to go out and get different stems to make them suit for me as I did I put shorter ones on them but 8.5 out of 10 is a cracking score for a dart really good dart very chuffed with it the 201 challenge as you can see 41 then a 140 left me with 20 I'm on 20 after 6 darts it took me 15 darts to hit the double oh Them's the breaks, they say, them's the breaks, but that's what makes darts the way it is. But, to recap on these, absolutely love them. If you like that kind of straight barrel with a little tapered front on it, good grip at the front, not so good in the middle and the rear because of the two smooth bands, but it shifted me down to tea because I'm a front gripper and it was brilliant. These are available to buy from St Helens Dart Shop. Little link up there. I'll put the phone number on the screen, going along the screen. You can phone them up, order them, get them next day delivery. They're also available from other stockists. Just search on the internet for them. You can buy them direct from Red Dragon's website too. But, absolutely brilliant. If you liked the video, please hit the little thumbs up. Let me know that you liked it. If you didn't like it, hit the thumbs down. Tell me why you didn't like it. Please hit the subscribe button. The more subscribers, the more content, the more giveaways. Winner, winner for you subscribers. Hit the little bell, the bell will tell you when the next video has been uploaded so you don't miss any competitions or anything that I'm running on the YouTube. I also run some competitions on my Twitter page, Scottish Cowboy Darts on Twitter. Follow me there, get some competitions there too. But most importantly, you guessed it, keep enjoying your darts and I'll catch you on the next review. <laughs>
from the beginning Fall in love all the way Say everything you've been afraid to say Then pick a fight, say goodbye 